Welcome to the Cabral Concept, where board certified doctor of naturopathy, Dr. Stephen Cabral, shares with you exactly how you can reverse aging, take back your health, and live a life full of energy and passion with new 20 minute episodes every single day to keep you healthy and engaged. Now, here's your host, Dr. Stephen Cabral. Welcome everyone, welcome to the Cabral Concept. Excited to go over a brand new healthy holiday guide for this season. Every single year I've been putting one out for maybe four or five years now. And I'll link to at least the previous year, if not the year before, that had a lot more items broken down by price range. So like a zero to 50, 50 to 100, 100 to 200, and then maybe like 200 plus. So I'll link that up for you at stephencabral.com slash 28. Four, eight. That's stephencabral.com slash 2848. But what I want to do is a little something different this year. Because a lot of people have been asking me, what do you still use? Like you, you do a Friday review and you recommend a new health tech gadget or you know device or food or supplement or whatever it might be. It's, it's anything that honestly, I think you can benefit from. So all of my resources, not all of them, but the ones that I, I still do recommend are at stephencabral.com slash resources. But there's over a hundred there. What I wanted to do was give you a top 20. So these are the ones that I didn't do any research or thinking back. These are the ones that immediately came to my head that I use on a near daily basis. That means like these have been really good investments for me because they're not things that I purchased once, which I've done a lot. So I'm, I, I'm not a, ashamed to admit that I bought many, many products and I do only use them for a week. That is what I wanna save you from. These are the ones that I use all the time and they're eclectic and some of them are totally random, but that's the way that I like to be. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give each one only 30 seconds, just 30 seconds to a minute maximum so I take you through the top 20. Now, these are in no order of importance except for number one, all right? So all of the rest of them, you can interchange in any order for me and I'd be totally fine, but number one is the one that for whatever reason, kind of really describes me. And so we'll get to that one. All right, so without further ado, let's dive right in. My healthy holiday shopping guide for the items that I still use all the time. All right, number 20 is this. I won't live without them. I won't sleep without them. They are the Cozy Earth Bamboo Sheets. Huge fan of these sheets. They are essentially 100% organic bamboo. But it's so weird when I tell people that because they feel like silk. They literally feel like you're sleeping on like just this really soft material and they temperature control. So the nice thing is when I get into bed and I might be hot or whatever it is, like they cool the body down. And so they're absolutely breathable. They're phenomenal. The softest sheets you'll ever fare feel and they are, well, besides being Oprah's top product for like three years in a row, they are the product that I love to give as a holiday gift because everybody who sleeps on them has the same reaction. They'll never sleep on anything else. So they're absolutely phenomenal. We now have two full sets. So when one goes in the wash, if we don't wash it right away, immediately we put another one back on. So it took us a few years to get a second set, but that's that. Okay. The second one is this a continuous glucose monitor. This is not something that I think you need to wear all the time. I really don't. I think this is something you get to learn and know about your body to a greater degree, and you wear it for two weeks to four weeks. I like to wear it every quarter as I kind of experiment with new foods, new diet plan, new, new whatever it might be. I don't make major tweaks. I pretty much always have the same breakfast, the same lunch. Um, if it's a workout day, I do a smoothie, um, peri-workout smoothie, and then I do dinner. So what I'm really looking at is, how does this green juice affect me? How does this carrot juice affect me? How does this new dinner that I've created affect me? So I look at those specific types of things and it can be really helpful. You know, I really enjoy that. I like to look at it with intermittent fasting. When I did my water fast, I did one as well. There's a bunch of great companies out there. Um, I'll, I'll recommend a few. I've recommended many in the past. We're currently using a company called Thea. Um, I'm going to link all these up for you so you don't have to kind of worry about them. We also, we have pretty good relationships with a lot of these companies. We don't own any of them. Um, but the truth is we've create relationships so that we can get you discounts. So all the discounts will be at stephencabral.com slash 2848. 
and I hope that I can get you a discount on every single one. So if you are purchasing these for yourself for the holidays or for others, uh, you'll find my my top 20 there and, and hopefully save yourself a little bit of money as well. All right, number 18, I just started using. I love the Berkey water filter. Don't get me wrong. I'm always going to have a Berkey in case there's an emergency and there's a brownout, which means no electricity. You need to be able to get good, clean water and your municipalities may not uh, be pumping and filtering that water the same way. I believe everybody needs a water filter no matter what. Um, I switched over to the AquaTrue. It is a countertop reverse osmosis that does not take up a lot of room. It's fantastic. It's easy to use. You can just add back in, you know, five or six drops of trace minerals to it. Uh, simple, easy to use, glass container, big fan. The filters last like six months. You'll need to replace them once, uh, tw twice a year, however you want to look at it. So um, that's that. All right, number 17, a tri-field EMF meter. And you know what? Maybe um, we could start to pop up images, you know, above uh, or maybe off to my side, off my shoulder, so you can kind of see what these look like. We'll do our best. And um, the EMF, uh, what, the tri-field EMF detector. So this is an important one because you literally may be sleeping next to, working next to a high EMF based device. And once you know, all you need to do is move that device, move your bed, move you, whatever you can do, or use my other tips, such as the Faraday tape or other things to block those EMFs. And there's a lot of Faraday, it's F-A-R-A-D-A-Y, devices that can block on um, these EMFs. So a tri-field EMF meter, there's also the, it's called like the GQ390 is another one that I've used that actually tests for 5G, but however you want to do it, um, those are great. And again, I'll, I'll link them up. All right. Number 16 goes along with the same one, and that is the EMF blockers by SafeSleeve. So I no longer keep my uh, phone next to me while I'm working. So unfortunately, I can't show it to you, but you've seen it many times. Um, and I've talked about this. This company I've literally been using since they came out, let's say six, seven years ago. I don't even know how long. But my daughters, uh, when we travel, they have their little mini iPads. So they've got a safe sleeve blocker on that. My wife, uh, who will work with her laptop kind of all over the place, all over the house, will have a safe sleeve laptop pad that it's kind of a nice wooden thing that you put underneath the laptop. And I have a safe sleeve on my phone and so does my wife as well. My, my girls, uh, they don't have phones yet. So a huge advocate. It's just a great device. It's super simple. You only need to replace it when you replace your phone. And if you replace it with the same size phone, well, you don't need to replace it. So these are great at blocking EMFs. And when you carry it on your body, you put the blocking side, the pad side, the case side towards your body. All right, so hopefully that's helpful. Number 15, this is one that I just got this year. It is the walking pad. Don't know how I technically made it without it when I lived in the Boston, New England area because I must have been getting a fraction of the steps that I really thought I was getting. And that is because I've done my tracking now. I see that if I'm not outside getting my steps in, I might only get like 5,000 steps for the day. So it's half of what I really want. So the walking pad is an inexpensive treadmill. It's And it's also tiny. So mine is under my desk right now. So I'm filming in my office and it's under my desk. So I have a standing desk and all I need to do is the walking treadmill folds in half. I unfold it. I press the power button, which is actually, it's a remote control, which is phenomenal. So I just press the power button, press the stop button if you need to. And I can walk at any speed I want up to like 3.75 miles per hour. It might even go a little faster, which is a fast, that's a good clip. I usually walk around three miles an hour. So huge fan of it. It's the easiest way to get in your steps. So if you live in an icy or cold area and you know you're not gonna get in your steps and you want something really small that will fold under your bed or under your desk, it's, I'm gonna look at it right now. Yeah, it's about three feet long. So that, that's all that it is. And so you unfold it, then it becomes around five feet or so. And it's only, let's say, six inches in, in total uh, depth or height, however you want to look at that. So big fan. It's just, you know, you, you need to have it if you're not getting in your steps. That's, that's the only way there is. Or just make laps around your house. But I would rather be um, doing my work, research, whatever, on a call and walking on this if it's not a good day out. 
All right, number 14 is the advanced renewal system. This is something that's new for me. And so if it's new for me, and I'm kind of playing with it to look at biological age, which I'll actually talk about in a little bit, um, one of my, my big passions right now is to play with and, and be able to manipulate the rate of aging. So instead of aging, aging for one year, biological year, for every one chronological year, year, the goal is to reduce that to 0.95 or less. So you are aging slower than your years. And this is something that I've really been looking into the last five years, but really the last three years. And I've, I've made some real headway over the last 12 months months. And over the last 12 months, I've been able to reduce my rate of aging from below, from above a one, I should say, to now at a 0 0.69, which is, um, which is pretty good. So excited about that. And ne the next step now, because I was using the advanced uh, renewal system um, in prototype, but we didn't have all those great nutrients at the time. The product just came out. So now I'm going to be using it and see if I can get that even lower. So I'm excited about that. It's a mitochondrial booster called Cell Boost. It has transrosferitrol. It has nicotinamide riboside. Uh, it has astragalus. has all the nutrients that your body needs, PQQ, et cetera. But then it also has a partner called Inflamasooth. And Inflamasooth has the ginger, the turmeric, the bromelain, all these great things that helps with inflammation as we get older. So looking forward to that. It's really my focus for 2024. All right. The next one is a full body MRI. Yes, it's expensive. I'm not going to, to argue with you about that. We found a few locations that we can get you a discount on, which is nice. Yes, it's expensive. But for the person who has everything that they're 40 plus, they want to early detect blood clots or cancer or um, you just say like a cysts or tumors or early Alzheimer's or spinal deviations, all of that can be picked up. It's incredible. Like it's incredible. It really is. And so, yes, it's expensive. Okay. A couple thousand dollars. You can get the torso one, which is basically from the neck down. So it doesn't do the brain. Um, and you, but it looks at all your organs. That's about half the price. So again, expensive, the rates will come down over time, but uh, but a phenomenal gift from you to you if you're able to or for someone else. Okay, the next one, opposite end of the range. Not a full body MRI, but some of my favorite olive oils. Again, hopefully we can pop up a few of these. So some people might say that I'm obsessed with olive oil and I think that they would be correct. So I go through a new bottle of olive oil every week, not every month, but every week. So my family consumes about 500 to 750 mLs, uh, milliliters of olive oil per week. It's a lot of olive oil. I have it with lunch and I have it with dinner. We bake with it. Uh, my daughters get it. My wife and I both use it and we use it fairly judiciously. You know, two to three tablespoons uh, at lunch. Um, it could be two to three tablespoons at dinner. Not every night, but we use it as a dressing. Okay, so I've tried now easily, easily, 50 plus different brands of olive oil. And I'm trying more all the time. Actually, if you look over my shoulder, there is another one over there that I'm about to try. And so maybe that'll make the list. But for right now, I can tell you this. I've tried all sorts of bottles and every month though to six weeks, I keep going back to one of my all-time favorites. And that is Desert Miracle. It is a single estate, early harvest, organic olive oil that has won so many awards for taste, flavor, and like polyphenol balance. Cold processed, dark bottle, amazing. Moroccan olive oil, I don't know, pretty fantastic. So I keep going back to that and uh, it's fantastic. It's, it's not expensive. You won't regret that olive oil purchase. All right. Can't get, get you any discounts there, but it's fairly inexpensive. The other one that I just tried about a month ago was called Kylo. And I don't know that that's the correct pronunciation. It could be Kilo. It's K-I-L-O. Probably is Kilo. It is a Greek olive oil, I believe. And it was very tasty. Great polyphenol profile. Very much enjoyed it. So I've tried a bunch. I've tried pretty much all the popular ones out there. Um, they're not, I, these two, are olive oil, just like wine is subjective as well. I'm not a big wine uh, guy. I'm not against wine. I don't know wine, uh, but I will tell you, 
I've got a, I've, I've tasted a few all, bottles of olive oil and uh, you can hear my passion just for olive oil. <laughs> These two are definitely worth trying. Okay. The next one, inexpensive as well. This has been a game changer. Use it all the time. 32 ounce glass smoothie bottle and it is a cylinder. So it fits very easily into my cup holder if I'm taking a drive or in my hand as I'm walking. No handle, just put my hand around the neoprene sleeve so it has neoprene around it or silicone around it so that you don't break the glass. Easy to wash in the dishwasher because uh, nobody wants to wash you know, all these different bottles by hand and especially 32 ounces, it's, you know, it's fairly deep. But this enables me because I like to have a 32 ounce smoothie, a full liter smoothie. I put 20 ounces of water in and then I put about uh, one and a half, two cups of fruit in there and then I put my powder in, my daily nutritional support. So huge fan of this. I use it all the time. Not expensive, but it doesn't have to be. Like you can use things that aren't super expensive as well, get a lot of value out of it. I know people love their Stanleys, right? They love their Stanley. It, yeah, it's great. No, no problem, no doubt about it, but it's a little bulkier than I want. And it definitely fits in a cup holder. That's the great thing about it. My wife uses hers every single day for her smoothie. And um, it also has a handle on it too. I'm not a handle kind of guy. I just want to put my hand around the cup, get on the go. Here we go. And also the Stanley's going to keep it really cold for a long time. I don't necessarily want that. Like I actually let mine warm up just a little bit and a little Ayurvedic thing. And so uh, that's what I do. All right. So pretty fantastic. We'll link that up as well. Number 10, completely random, totally random. I, I, I came up with this product. I formulated this product. It's called the daily fruit and vegetable blend, the crisp apple flavor. It's absolutely delicious. I always did it on its own. I always did it basically when I woke up with my different enzymes that I'm taking, um, but I would never put it in my smoothie because I thought it would ruin the taste of the smoothie. I literally have thought that for like six years, seven years. I added a scoop of the uh, apple crisp, the daily fruit and vegetable blend, which is 22 organic fruits, vegetables, and superfoods. And I added it to my purple car smoothie, which is my wild blueberries. And it is um, uh, half a frozen banana. And sometimes I add in some mango frozen mango. And then I add in my um, vanilla daily nutritional support, or I do a scoop of vanilla and a scoop of chocolate, which I love. The chocolate's great, you know, as well. But I started adding in the crisp apple and I like it even more. So I'm like, I don't know if my taste buds changed or what it is, but for someone that's looking to get in another serving of fruits and veggies every day, easiest way to do it. And also, like most people, I don't eat 22 different superfoods or fruits and vegetables every day. So that has been a game changer for me that I continue to do ongoing. If you have someone in your life that doesn't eat enough fruits and vegetables because they're worried about the carbs, the sugar, whatever, this is basically a, a zero sugar way to do that. Uh, very simple, very clean. Anyway, that's it. So huge fan of it. Now I do that every day. <laughs> All right. Next one, Soma Vedic. So a lot of people hear me talk about that little Soma Vedic I have right over my shoulder. We have the, I, so I've used Soma Vedics now for uh, let's say about five years, maybe six, but right around five to six years. Okay. So the first one I ever used back then was called the Green Medic, but now it's called the Vedic. And it helps to structure water. It helps to emit what's called scalar waves. So it can improve heart rate variability. So all of these things, I don't have the worksheets anymore on my desk, but you can actually do before and after. It's like I used to draw blood in my practice and I would look at dried blood cell uh, analysis. So I'd look at uh, dark field and I'd look at um, dried blood cell and, and, and uh, live blood analysis. And you can actually see, like you can verify that. So do I believe that it's blocking EMFs? No, but I do believe since it has a Tesla coil inside of it and it has um, precious gemstones that it's emitting its own higher frequencies and they have water testing as well. And they can actually see the crystallization in the water versus not using uh, a Soma Vedic. So a uh, big fan of this. They actually just debuted their immune system one, two. So I'll, I'm going to put it to you this way. When in doubt, like which one do I choose? I would always go with the Vedic. That's, that's the one that I'd recommend because it also does water structuring and it does a much larger field for EMF protection. So that's one that we've used in my house for many, many years. Uh, I used it yeah, I use it in my practice. My wife's art. She's like, why, why don't we have one of these at home? And I said, okay, well, I'm not going to buy another. So I'm going to bring this now home. Now, of course, I bought another one, uh, which is a smaller one that you can actually travel with. Very, very small and, and nice as well. Okay, that's number nine. Number eight is the chili pad cooling system for sleep. If you are someone that gets hot during the middle of the night, they sweat or they wake up or their partner doesn't like the room very cold, but you prefer it cold. It's a great one. You can get a half mattress pad and you can actually set it to whatever temperature you like. I'm telling you right now, this will improve HRV, 
This will also improve deep sleep. And you can set it for whatever temperature you like. It's Yeah, it's fantastic. They've been around a long time. They used to be called the Chili Pad um, or Chili Sleep. Now they're called Sleep Me, I believe. And so we'll, we'll link that up too. All right, the as we're down now, we're to number seven, blue blockers. I now have like eight pairs of blue blockers, which is completely out of control. I completely understand that. Um, but I'm at a computer a lot now. So these are the ones that I love to wear during the day. These are my Claire Frame uh, Viva Rays. I love my Equalife blue blockers, which are less expensive ones, but they block out evening, um, so they're 90, 95% blue blockers, and I wear those because they're super lightweight, and I wear those if I'm watching TV or have screen time at night. And then there are the other Viva Rays that actually have three different lenses as I dropped them but caught them with my legs. Um, they have the daytime use, Okay, the light yellow. They have the orange lens, which clips right on for evening use as the sun is setting. And then they have the red lenses, which is to completely block out blue rays. And that's for a half hour to an hour before bed. So the complete system, Viva Rays does a great job at it. They've got a really um, excellent founder. They've got a good mission from which they stand upon, which I love to hear. And um, then if you're looking for a less expensive pair, well, Equalife it's not less effective, it's just less expensive. And um, and you can also get a single pair there. Not the three system, but the evening ones you can get as well. And we'll link both up. Okay, number six is a biological age test. We have not really come up with new labs. We've been using the same ones which test everything you can imagine. Hormones and gut testing and omega-3s and inflammation and vitamin D and everything under the sun. However, there is a new lab that we partnered with with a company that actually gets great results that shows you your biological age, so different than your chronological, let's say you're 45, well we hope that your biological age might be 42. And it also shows you your rate of aging. So as I talked about that before, are you at a one to one for rate of aging? Are you aging faster than your chronological age or are you aging slower? That's been my goal to reduce that biological age. And I do things to say, oh, did this help or hurt? And sometimes it hurts, I'm like, okay, well that's not, it's just providing too much stress in the body. Let's do something that helps a little bit. So all of those things are what I'm playing with, playing with right now. I'm gonna be sharing with you all my findings at highperformancehealth.org. So you can definitely check out the blog when that's up over there and much more. Okay, so that is the biological age test. Uh, it's a new, fun, amazing test. It also shows your AP, APOE genotype. If you don't know if you're a 3-3, 2-3, uh, three, four, 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 all the different variations. There are only really six, but um, you can find that out there. And if you have an MTHFR gene mutation, which means typically that you need the methylated form of folate, B12, and, and other vitamins as well. Okay, so that's a great one. Number five is a PEMF mat, a PEMF mat. And why I love this is yes, I've been using it for years, but now, like very strategically, I use it post workout and I lie down on it either inside of the sauna that I bring it into or on a flat, essentially massage table or just on the ground. And I was doing this because anecdotally, myself and my private wellness clients were getting great recovery from it. But then I'm listening to a podcast, Dr. Andy Gelpin, uh, Huberman, and they were chatting about lying down on your back for five to 10 minutes and doing box breathing, even three to five minutes, and how it helped dramatically with exercise recovery. And I'm like, oh, I'm like anecdotally, I knew this was working. My colleagues, or I should say my, my clients I gave it to, they felt it was working. And now there's new research that shows how it works. So pretty fantastic. So I love that PMF mat. And you can just lie on it on the couch at night as well to help with inflammation, rejuvenation. Number four, a red light mask. Okay, I've had a red light mask from higher dose now for about two years. Do I use it all the time? No, I do not. Should I use it all the time? Yes, I should. So why am I talking about it if I said this is a list of the things that I use the most often? Here's why. I'm gonna start to use it. 2024, honestly, here's the thing. I don't really want, like, I don't care as much, and I don't mean this in a negative way, but I know that I'm going to get older. Like, that's a thing. And I'm not trying to like push back age forever. Like that's not my goal. My goal is this is a game. I wanna, I wanna extend my youthfulness for as long as I can. I'm in my mid 40s right now, okay? So chronologically, I'm not getting any younger. But I have as much energy as I ever have in my life. There's no signs of me slowing down. But am I starting to look a little older? Yes, I am. And, and again, like I'm okay with that. However, 
What if this is a new game I can play? And so what I want to do are things that can help with a little bit of rejuvenation without going overboard. Like I'm talking about 10 minutes a day. I'm not really, I'm not willing to dedicate more than 10 to 15 minutes, but here's what I can do. I can use the red light mask inside of the sauna. I can use it while I'm doing something else. So I am going to do this and I'm going to do one other thing, which is micro needling. So better skincare, micro needling, and I'm going to use the red light mask. And, and then I'm just, I'm sure that in six months, I'll look like I'm 18 years old again. <laughs> All right. Number three is an infrared sauna. Now choose your favorite company, choose uh, less expensive, choose mid range, choose high range. I've used them all. I love them all. The Thera360 the Thera Plus, great investment. Contains red light, contains your sauna, your infrared sauna. It only takes up about three feet by three feet. So small footprint, uh, great product, no doubt about it. And I have a high-end infrared sauna as well that um, I'm going to be unveiling soon and do a full product review. But if you want, I'll give you first look here today and you can find that at stephencabal.com slash 2848. I love this sauna. It's literally um, a two-person sauna. You can buy a three-person. It's absolutely perfect. Perfect for two people, like my wife and I can go in it, or one person to put their legs up and stretch out their legs as long as they're not like 6'2 or above. All right, now, and if, if so, you just gotta bend your knees a little bit. All right, number two is an air doctor. So if you don't filter your air, I can't recommend, like you have to do this. For mold, for toxins in the environment, get an air doctor. We use the 5,000 for a big room. It covers a lot of space. You can also get the 3,000 worth your while. Like it really is. All right, and the very last one is going to be, and I've got my brand new puppy, Wyan over here. So let me see if I can debut him on video. All right, come here, Bachi. All right, his very first debut on video only because uh, he's whining a little bit and he's an amazing King Charles Cavalier. All right, buddy, just a few minutes and I'll take you out. The last one though is the Aura Ring. So I told you that if there was only one that I use every day that I don't wanna live without, it's my Aura Ring. And I know that seems kind of strange, but it just gives you a little bit of an insight into how my brain works. I love looking at health tech. I love looking at improvements. I love looking at growth. I love understanding when I'm not having a good day, what I did in order to make it a poor day or how I made it a better day. What does my sleep look like? What is my deep sleep? What is my REM? What's my heart rate variability? I love testing. I love variables. I do believe that we can figure out our health and anything we want to achieve if we know how to test variables. I truly believe that. Now, uh, Aura Ring just does a great job and it's not invasive. Like, yes, a watch is great. All these things are great, but wearing a ring on your hand to sleep is not invasive at all. I also do not allow it to dictate my next day. I don't even look at the stats typically to the following afternoon or so. So I'm not going to get in my head about, was it a good night's sleep or bad night's sleep? No, I'm going to live my day, but a uh, big fan of that. So hopefully this was helpful. Again, all the links, all the discount codes that we've gotten for you will be available at stephencabral.com slash 2848. This was helpful. Feel free to share it with anyone you believe it could serve. Take care, everybody. Ever wonder what the best sauna, blue blockers, sleep trackers, wake lights, salt lamps, or other health gadgets are? Or what about the top non-toxic mattresses, sheets, soaps, bath products, toothpaste, and cookware? Or would you like to know the cleanest choices for hemp parts, meal delivery services, supplements, and much more? I personally curated, researched, and now created a resource page of all of my top picks that continues to grow each week. These are the exact products I use in my own life, with my family, in my private practice, and they're the ones I trust. To find out all of my up-to-date recommendations and all the details, simply head on over to stephencabral.com forward slash resources.